You're a crazy horse, you know that? You are a crazy bird killing horse. I just forgot my camera in the worst possible time. I was done at work, then I was going to rust, and um, when I got almost there, I remembered that my camera was at my locker, at my place of business. So I had to turn around in rush hour traffic, and there's just so many cars. And um, I thought that maybe I could be lucky and just get away with it. That um, cars would disappear magically within the time that I got back, got my camera and got in the car again. I now just drove like uh, three, four, five hundred feet or six hundred feet with no traffic. But now... I wasn't all that lucky. Now everything is basically just still. I bought in some food and some uh, yeah, soda and stuff like that. So at least we have food at rest while we do our paperwork. Because this is gonna be a long evening, I guess. And then I'm gonna drive back home, sleep for a few hours, go back to work, go back to rest, do more paperwork, and yeah. So I have a lot of work to do this weekend. I want to talk about a thing that I saw in the news today. I thought it was... I didn't actually know why this happened. But in Norway, since uh, the last five, six or maybe seven years, we in Norway have not had these really good chocolate cigarettes. They, they come like in a cigarette pack. And they look just like ordinary cigarettes, except that there's chocolate inside. So it's just a wrapper that you open up and it reveals a chocolate cigarette. And also we used to have these licorice pipes, you know. And uh, I haven't seen either the pipes or the chocolate cigarettes in years. However, I found out why today. I don't know if you guys know this, but Norway want to do a total ban on cigarettes and tobacco and yeah, basically anything that can harm you in any way. And the reason why the chocolate cigarettes and the licorice pipes are not in shelves anymore is because they are considered a tobacco product. So they can't be in the shelves. That's also a thing in Norway, by the way. Cigarettes can't be anywhere people can see them. They have to be behind closed doors, behind a counter. So, because these licorice pipes have the shape of a pipe, it can't be shown in the store. That would break the law. And the same thing with the chocolate cigarettes. I mean, come on! How crazy is that? I mean, that's a crazy law, right? I mean, it's not just me. Everybody thinks this is crazy, right? And now, finally, the politicians have realized that this is a dumb law. And we might get licorice pipes and chocolate cigarettes back in the stores. Hooray! The chocolate cigarettes are really good, actually. So, I'm kind of looking forward to that. The horse has freaking killed a seagull. My dad saw the seagull was alive and then the horses started tramping it and now he's dead and they're still kicking him and my dad saw this like an hour ago and the horses are still kicking the dead bird what the hell's going on it's just like between the legs of the brown horse can barely see it if the horse moves a little bit no wait maybe it's underneath the feet of the white one they've been tramping it forever I didn't know horses could kill stuff dude it's a killer horse <laughs>
This is sensational. Look at the dead bird, guys. It's in the behind the back legs of the horse. Did you kill a bird? Did you kill the bird? Okay, so before you put your child on one of these monsters, know that they can trample shit to dead. It's crazy. That's a dead seagull. And I have no idea how they got him to die in the first place or how they injured him enough to not be able to fly. Because now he's just dead, man. It stopped when when we opened the window to record a video, but it was like trampling the shit out of this dead bird. Look! It's dead. You're a crazy horse, you know that? You are a crazy bird killing horse. Crazy horsey. So what do you do when you want to eat but you have no fork? You make one. Perfect, but it will feed me. Eating baby food? No. But my fork works like a charm. Mm. <laughs> Homemade? Yeah. A whore in my hair. <laughs> my whore. <laughs> whore in my hair. My hair is getting too long. I'll have to cut it soon. Mm, 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 mm. Shall we go to uh, yeah. heavy metal or something? <laughs> now we got it. We got it now. <laughs> Goal achieved. <laughs> Get head banging here in, in 2016. If you had a 27 inch iMac and you could do anything you wanted with it, what would you do? I want suggestions to what we can do with our iMac. We're gonna destroy that thing. So if you have a cool suggestion, please write it in the comment section below. And if we get a cool suggestion, we're gonna do it. So, and we're, of course, we're gonna record it and post it on my blog. So please give me some comments uh, as to what we can do with an iMac. Uh, the best suggestion wins, I guess.